Hey, hey. This is the eighth episode of my uh, 1910 uh, German campaign where I only use uh, German uh, battle cruisers. And I dream about uh, bringing down the British Empire. And I believe the next mission here is the Vipertal against uh, some screens. I um, might have mentioned it earlier, but the Vipertal is uh, a ship I have a uh, soft spot for. It's definitely one of the main characters of this campaign. So let's see if we can uh, pull it through this uh, engagement without too much uh, damage. Mm, no, we're uh, turning around this way if there's some uh, torpedo boats coming here. Oh, that might be a bad idea. I should have turned the other way now. Definitely need to get a very shallow angle here on the way back. Because he probably launched torpedoes. But these are only screens though, so uh, they'll uh, go down pretty quickly, especially at this range. It's so hard to hit these uh, destroyers. The speed modifier uh, still is pretty out of whack in uh, 108. Oh yeah, there we go. Uh, I believe the uh, cruiser was up here somewhere. Yeah, this has to be the cruiser. Well, that's the heavy cruiser, armored cruiser, and these are light cruisers then. I really, really love this effect, to be honest. Oh, torpedoes in the water. If I haven't seen them by now, they're probably very slow. Yeah. Yeah, quite slow. I want to get rid of the Liverpool before it can uh, smoke up again. I'm not even trying to uh, close the distance to use their torpedoes. It would be really nice if we could have a feature to pre-turn these uh, turrets on our own. That was a pretty quick engagement. It's, uh, you know, not really a big, uh, big surprise that my battle cruiser ate up their screens. It's uh, kind of what they're designed to do, right? Hmm, salvage crew. 
one crew. Okay, yeah, I, I think I saw this in the patch notes, so this is new for me at least. And let's just um, jump into the next... Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. I need to check. I need to check uh, because it's been so long since I checked this campaign. This is the first time I, I'm getting new, fresh footage in quite a while. And the British, they still had almost twice my GDP, but their growth is negative while my, mine is positive. So I'm, I'm happy about that. Uh, we're doing okay financially. Very okay. I could build even more of these battle cruisers, which is uh, impressive since I know they've been buffing the the maintenance costs in every single patch uh, the past few weeks. There's um, nothing particularly I need to get here. I think uh, so far. And we have all the ships we need, I think, in port or at least near the North Sea. So we can just go to the next round. So the tension between the French and the Italians are uh, dramatically uh, falling or increasing. Um, while the French, they're... Uh, they, they're on good terms with us. They even wanted an alliance previously. Okay, now that we see, uh, this didn't happen in the last patch, but or the last time I played it. But now, now the transport ships, uh, uh, the British are starting to hemorrhage transport capacity. Uh, maybe strangling them won't take that long after all. And I don't know how much uh, the... Uh, the effective range of my ship design affects this. I would imagine it does, and I'm I'm quite pleased with sinking like twenty ish uh, uh, ships in a single turn. That's definitely going to put a strain on them. Look at this. Uh, well, I had a negative too, but uh, even if their if their uh, GDP is uh, declining more than mine, I'm happy. I'm happy because the British is the big bad. Uh, uh, you know, enemy to look out for in uh, any European campaign, probably. Yeah, no, there's uh, nothing particularly here I want other than getting... I mean, I'm getting, going to get this sooner or later anyway. Um, I probably have to aim to get uh, a new design out soon, because I know people want to see that. Uh, I'll wait until I see what control station gives me uh, before I do anything like that. So uh, let's just check how many do we have in port ready? Oh yeah, yeah, there, there's a lot. Um, this box is so big and it, when I'm on this side, it hides the port or areas it, it is in and it's oh, the same here. Let's just beat them at least one more turn in the North Sea before I start. Uh, putting my, sh my ships in the Irish and English channel. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is the war where we're uh, finally going to uh, finish off the British Empire. So this is um, six of my battlecruisers against a uh, battleship and a, ba a battlecruiser and three screens. Their uh, BB is a 12-incher and the battlecruiser is a 10-incher. I think I've fought these designs before and it's not, you know, anything uh, terribly uh, scary. Yeah, they are spotted to the southeast. There we go. This is the battleship. Just put all the big guns on it. Yeah, we probably have torpedoes on our way. Oh, oh. Mm, 
let's see, let's see. Uh, everybody, this direction, break, and don't avoid. Uh, Bob might get hit. Well, maybe if he just uh, goes straight ahead instead of following into the turn, then it'll be fine. It takes a while to, you know, re-merge these ships when we have to break the line, but I, I assume it would do that in real life anyway, so I'm not, I'm not going to uh, nag on it too much. It's a bit gamey, maybe. It looks like the queen is about to go down as well. Can't be easy being a royalist in these uh, proving times. I guess uh, God won't save the queen in this case. <laughs> I didn't even realize this, but I guess it really is uh, proving times for uh, the royalists, huh? Fairly well armored, designed for a battle cruiser. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I didn't even pay attention to these guys. The, he, Gibraltar had torpedoes the last time I saw it. But considering I haven't really taken any damage, I presume they just blew up or something. Uh, well, it's hard to tell. Uh, the second meeting engagement is against screens, so this should also be a very easy fight. Uh, I'm not going to order resolve it, even if it's screens, because I have a feeling I'll lose uh, something to torpedoes. Okay, the enemy is to the north, the direction we're heading. Get a slight V-shape, and let's just... Uh, okay, we can do it in this direction as well. Okay, like 10 uh, clicks up, out. Uh, the armored cruiser got a solid hit on him. Yeah, <laughs> that's a weak attempt. It even blew up. Good, I don't want to see those torpedoes. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, that was quick and easy. Uh, even if I only had one battle cruiser there, I think I would have killed them all pretty easily. And we recovered some uh, crew. Uh, we lost one transport ship and none of the British ones. Hmm. Well, it's fine. It's fine. Wait, why is my monthly balance so bad? Is this because they're repairing? Uh, probably. Probably. There's nothing left to say. Uh, my displeasure is immeasurable and my day is ruined. What are the politicians doing? We could have ruled this uh, continent. There could have been Savikraut on every diner table for decades to come.
these islands are worthless to me, in my opinion. Uh, I have to defend these islands if I take them. It's a lot easier to just focus on the North Sea. Yeah, I got the better out of him, but this is a hollow victory. This is not how it was supposed to go down. Oh well, there's always the next war, huh? Always the next war. Um, I need to put these guys into uh, ports so I don't have to spend so much maintaining them. I think that's going to be more important uh, from now on. Um, they're they're more they're richer than me. I need to strangle them. Oh. Okay, let's see if we can get something cool. Uh, advanced towers. Mm. No. Uh, so I'm realizing that I have new uh, cruiser holes and that I can build a new uh, battle cruiser. But unfortunately, the original uh, footage is so full of my snot that you would be disgusted to listen to it. So I cut it out. You're welcome. And we need to check uh, our balance uh, once this turn is over. And that's the end of this episode. Uh, in the next episode, we're probably uh, going to be redesigning our battle cruisers. And I have to really rant out there. Uh, I spend so much time and energy editing these videos, but uh, I have bronchitis I had during the recording of this, and I still kind of have. And it takes so much time and energy uh, just editing out the audio so you don't have to listen to my uh, spit and snot uh, throughout it. Uh, I, I can remove the words of it, but it's my the voice in the original uh, recordings are still going to be kind of flat, so there's really not much to do about that. The good part is though that I am uh, going to upgrade my audio equipment pretty soon, so uh, the focus will be on uh, improving the overall audio quality. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode.